and then pass the uh, proclamation officially. So this is a proclamation of the city of Clarkson recognizing Somaliland's human right of self-determination and, and sovereign statehood. Whereas understanding that the Somaliland peoples who live in Clarkston contribute to the social fabric of the city and value their human right to self-determination as a people, for Somaliland to enjoy fully recognized status as a sovereign state by the international community, to include the United States and African Union. And whereas, recognizing that since 1991, Somaliland has had a democratically elected government and president in this time, there have been five elections and changes of president. And whereas acknowledging that because the international community has failed to recognize Somaliland's right to self-determination and sovereign statehood, Somaliland has not been able to receive much needed international aid. Whereas benefiting from the fact that Somaliland has safeguarded international waters, preventing lawlessness such as piracy for decades, and whereas recognizing Somaliland will aim to strengthen cooperation in the fight against terrorism, extremism, piracy, illegal fishing, toxic dumping, and other serious crimes. And whereas appreciating the fact that immigrants have provided the United States with unique social and cultural influence, fundamentally enriching the extraordinary character of our nation. And whereas supporting the Somaliland's government's belief that recognition would entrench democracy in the Horn of Africa, and whereas understanding that immigrants have been tireless leaders not only in securing their own rights and access to equal opportunity, but have also campaigned to create an equitable and more just society for all Americans. And whereas believing that mar marketing Somaliland as a safe tourist destination, primarily cultural and e ecotourism, could also emerge as an important segment of the Somaliland economy. And whereas understanding that despite their countless contributions, the role of immigrants in building and enriching our nation has frequently been overlooked and undervalued throughout our history and continuing to the present day. And whereas recognizing Clarkson's council will be the first local authority in the US to recognize Somaliland. However, other local authorities such as Sheffield, Cardiff, and Tower Hamlets of the United Kingdom have also done the same. And now, therefore, I, Mayor Ted Terry, on behalf of the City of Clarkston and its City Council, do hereby proclaim that today is Somali Land Independence Day. human rights of self-determination and a sovereign state. I second that. Second. All in favor, raise your hand, say aye. Aye. So we have all of you, your beautiful faces in the crowd, and we want to take a picture um, of this moment. Why don't the council come to y'all? Everyone stay still, maybe stand a little bit, and anyone who's our photographer, let's take a photo together, okay? Let's do this. Yeah. <laughs> Let's um, enjoy this in the 88. On behalf of all the Somali landers who are here today, and the rest of Somali landers in the entire globe, from Europe, Australia, the US, Africa, and all around, we want to take this opportunity to thank the city of Clarkston for the proclamation that you are about to undertake about the sovereignty of Somaliland. Mayor Ted Terry, City Manager Keith Parker, Council Members Andrea Cavon, Kiki Bell, Kenny Carroll, Awed Yaza, Ahmed Hassan, and Mario Walker. Look Williams, we do appreciate it tremendously. The train has moved. It's not if one Somalia will be recognized as a sovereign nation, then when? The train is moving towards its final destination for Somalia to become a member of nation states and take its rightful place in the UN, the AU, and other world organizations. And as far as I know, Clarkson is the first city or the first government entity in the US that has undertaken this proclamation. Once again, we thank you, 
and a lot of his work towards going to the state capital of Georgia and many other states until we go to the U.S. government's recognition of Somaliland. Thank you. Sammy Abdullah, I appreciate you so much. Um, I just want to tell you that we, uh, my people of Somaliland is watching you live, even though it's early in the morning and middle of the night, it's seven hours difference, but people are tuned to Clarkston website tonight, watching these historic events, because this is the right of the human rights, uh, people's human rights for self-identification, and I know Mario, how that is important to you, but I want to thank you all and tell you this is on behalf of my government, on behalf of the, my, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Somaliland, and on behalf of the Diaspora Agency and all uh, my people back home who are tuned and waiting to be seated and waiting for equity and justice to be done and for the case to be heard because they've actually fulfilled all the requirements to be a, a, a statehood. And this is really a historic event. You have no idea how this is um, a time in history that would be written about Clarkston as a welcoming place and a place where we feel that it's a home and all of you are not just the mayor and the city council members, but also personal friends. Thank you. very much for coming. Uh, I'm not going to uh, give a history for the Somali Lounges because they know why they're here. I'm just going to give a little history to my friends, uh, Clarkson citizens, who are here today. Uh, in 1960, Somaliland gained its independence from the British colony and joined it with the southern Somalia who gained their independence from the Italian. They together made Somali Republic. Unfortunately, on the 1990, that government collapsed and the country went to anarchy and a chaos. That's when Somaliland went back and took their independence back. Although unrecognized, the international community of Somaliland has its own flag, parliament, currency, national identity, passports, army, police, constitution, transportation, and all legal systems for government function for 25 years. Its presidents come to power through much contest election, sometimes won with the narrowest margins, unlike many other African countries. The result are respected, even though the opposition wins. After 25 years of self-governing, with a population of 3.5 million, without recognition, Somaliland people are arguably one of the most stable, peaceful, and democratic places in Horn of Africa. Yeah. If you hear Somalia, if you hear Al Shabaab, if you hear Black Hawk Down, if you hear Bamsa happening in Somalia, Chopin, no, that is the southern part of Somalia. The northern part of Somalia has been peaceful for 25 years. We're hoping Somaliland to be recognized as an independent nation. Thank you. Uh, uh, yes, ma'am. Yes. Uh, Go ahead. <laughs> So, so I'm a refugee person, and I want to explain to my people for what I'm saying Somali. But I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, and I had a little bit of a class, مکه وقت که یه ولها هلای اینو گونی است که که هر نام خاص و قحنی وقت که کنفرت دگرگل دی سکه ای که دعای سومالیا دمان اکوفیدای و حالا من تحت نسخه می سی آن میشن آن دیگرین احتلاس دن آن کنولین سی 1990 قحی آن سومر نکتی 
Me and the Vira, put it behind. Me and the Vira, put it behind. 